What is up, lads? It's CMG here. Right. We need to have a discussion. We need to have this serious, serious discussion. And I did promise you guys, I said, if you did actually watch the video that in question, which was the, uh, the Overwatch and Chill video where I was playing The Floor is Lava, I said right at the end of that video, I said we were going to have a discussion about May. Uh, because there are a few things that I need to discuss. And I've got to do it now while everything is quiet. Because you never know with Blizzard. Blizzard might bring something out at the time of me recording this. And then all this all this recording will be just deemed pointless. However, I will need to get my message across. I need to get my point across. Now, I've got this skin up. I've got the Ma Mary Winter Wonderland skin that we got as Overwatch... Well, if we played the game long enough, at least anyway... <laughs> We got this skin back in 2016. The very, very first Winter Wonderland event. May got this skin. Now, if you remember that far back, you'll know this skin had a bit of controversy behind it. In that this is not a legendary skin when you think about it. When you look at this, like every, every May fan looks at this skin and understands the reason why. I'm gonna go- I'm gonna get to it in a minute. May has the skin and well, look at it. It's- it li it literally is an overpriced epic skin. Now, if you look at- if you look at this skin and you look at some of the other skins- Sorry about battery level low. Sorry, ignore that please. You'll notice a few things. Now, this design, this- this fluffy coat design with um- with the sort of fluff around it. Uh, the- the boots, the gloves, you know, everything. It's, it all looks very, very similar to this skin, right? This right here. Now, this is the point I want to make, is that... May needs a Winter Wonderland skin. She absolutely desperately needs it. I mean, look, look. The, it literally looks the exact same. If you go to a common, if you look at the epics, it's the exact same design. Now, obviously because of the fact that this is one of the older legendary skins... We, as Overwatch fans back then, didn't really know what a legendary skin or an epic skin was going to look like. I mean, we didn't think that by any chance we'd get skins like this, or this, or this. You know, these skins came later in Overwatch's life. Uh, the fact that we got this was con controversial. I mean, the only differences with this skin... She has a Christmas hat, you know, the actual suit itself... When you pair the red, the green, and the yellow, the, the white, sorry. It looks Christmassy. It looks like a Christmas suit when you look at it. The only other difference as well is when she turns into a snowman when she cryos. As opposed to just a big ice block. But that's it. That's literally it. That's the only difference. Well, the only difference is that determines this of it being a legendary skin. The point I'm trying to make is, ladies and gentlemen, is that she needs a legendary skin. For this Winter Wonderland event. If she does not get a Winter Wonderland event skin. For this year. I'm going to be very very disappointed. I mean look. I understand. Look, let me, let's just cast your mind back to. The very very early stages of Overwatch. Where you can understand as May fans. Right. She got the lion's share of the legendary skins. Like she was getting a legendary skin. Pretty much every event. Let's be honest. She got the. She got, she got this skin. She got the. The two Lunar New Year skins. Which, to this day, remains the only two skins that have colour abbreviations for an event. So yeah, May's pretty substantial in terms of that factor. Then she got the Beekeeper one, I believe. That was the next one. Then she got the, uh, the, the, the Pyjamas one. Then she got the Jiangxi skin. And then she got the Honeydew one. Now, this skin right here, the Honeydew one... I mean, my god, <laughs> look at the waist. I mean, that that is just literally not possible. The point I'm trying to make is, this Honeydew May skin is the latest skin to come out. This came out back in July 2019 for the, the anniversary event. So it has been a good year and a bit since we got a May skin. Now I can understand why this, is this has been possible, because May had a lot of skins prior to this. So, for us to not have a May skin 
for this period is understandable. It would have been nice to have a Summer Games skin for May because Summer Games is the only event in Overwatch that May doesn't have a skin for. She hasn't had a skin all year, let's be honest, uh, for 2020 at least. So for her to get a skin now would be really, really good for her. Honestly, I look at this skin and yes, it's Christmassy. Yes, it does have a, a Santa's hat. Yes, it does look like she looks like Mrs. Claus. I get it. But I just look at it and think it's just missed opportunity. She needs to have a skin where we can clearly say it's a legendary skin for me for Winter Wonderland. I look at this. It's not a skin. It, it isn't. It's, a, it's an overpriced epic skin. I mean, I wouldn't be surprised, right? If this skin, if for those of you that don't have this skin, I mean, it'd be very, very surprising if you don't have the skin because it's been in the game for like five years because it's been one of the old skins. But I wouldn't be surprised if this is a skin that you get if you get nine wins. You know, you know those skins that you get for events where if you get nine wins for a week, you get that skin. This looks like one of those skins. It literally, like you go into Overwatch and you get nine wins and you and you'll get this skin it looks like one of those skins but we all need to come together guys as may supporters and we need to plead we need to put our hands together please jeff blizzard please give may a legendary skin for this event i beg please 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 we've been waiting patiently as may fans we haven't had a skin for a year and a bit now is the time to send it out. I mean, look, like I said earlier, I could end up doing this video. I could end up saying all of this and then suddenly Blizzard just drop something on Twitter or something like that or just makes this video completely pointless, right? In which case, I'll end up just having to do another video on the side talking about said skin. But I mean, while everything is quiet, while everything is settled right now, and is an opportunity to speak out. We need something for me. I don't even know how else to say it. Like even Junkrat has more skins in Winter Wonderland than me. All right. So when we look at Junkrat. Let's have a look at the skins that he's got. Right. For Winter Wonderland. Right. He's got this skin. Which let's be honest. The reason why he's got a summer skin for the Winter Wonderland event. Is because in Australia. It's actually summer in December. So that's the reason why he gets this skin in, in December. But he's also got this. He's also got the Krampus skin, which he got like two years ago. I, it's just mind-boggling how Junkrat has got these two skins. And yet May over here, who, by the way, by the way, is a winter-themed hero that shoots an ice gun. Like something that you come out of, you know, from a snow scene. And yet all she gets is this. Come on, Blizzard. We need to get, we need something for May. Please, I, I beg, I beg. I speak for every single May fan out there, myself included, when I say we need a May skin, okay? Please, Blizzard, please, please. Look at my currency. I've got 5,000 in the kitty. It is literally ready. My money is ready, not, not my real life money, but my, my, my coins are ready to get in on it and buy that skin, whatever it may be, if there even is one. Blizzard, just do the right thing. Give the... Look, there's so many different concepts for May. There's so many different really good May concepts for Winter Wonderland. I'm not going to just put them up on the screen because I'm lazy. But just Google May Winter Wonderland skin concepts. And I'm sure you'll see quite a lot of them. So please, Blizzard, if, you, if you're watching... You probably aren't watching because I'm not popular anyway. But still, still, give May... The all-important Winter Wonderland legendary skin that she deserves. Please. I beg. I beg. Do it. Do it. Do it. Drop it. Do whatever you need to do. Dude, I, I, I'll end up just editing this video, uploading it, and then suddenly Overwatch will drop something. I know them. It's happened before. It's happened before in numerous times where... I make a video and I get it uploaded and then suddenly just Overwatch just drops something and then then I've got another video to do. <laughs> but yeah, um, this has been me talking nothing but gibberish, I would have thought. For those of you that don't know anything about Overwatch and you've just been looking at this, you probably don't know what's going on. But for those of you that play a lot of Overwatch like me and you're a big May fan like me, you'll understand why I'm babbling on about this. 
Uh, it is something that needs to be done. Give me that skin, ladies and gentlemen. If you agree with this, please give it a like. Give this video a like or whatever. I really do appreciate all the likes I get, even though technically I don't really get very many likes or comments or views or whatever. But still, it's, it's the opinion that counts, right? So anyway, thank you very much for watching this video, guys. If you did enjoy the video, please like, comment, subscribe. Follow me on Twitter at chrisman 9 Check me out on my social medias that will be in the description box down below. Check out my Discord server as well and click on that notification bell if you want to be updated with any videos I intend to do in the future. Have a great day. Have a great life. Be nice to your fellow gamers because we're all human beings. I have been CMG and until the next video, I shall see you later. Peace.